All right, welcome back to another episode of The K-Files, episode number six. Today I want to share a little story about the Ellie River Jump, the infamous Ellie River Jump from the TV show Days of Jackass. I remember showing up to the location and uh, all of us had to hop the fence. You know, it, it felt like, you know, being on a skate shoot. You go to the school, you hop the fence, you get your photos, and you get out of there before you get kicked out either by the security or the cops showing up. Uh, we were all, at the time, we were all new to everything. We didn't know you had to have a permit. I think we were just still in the infancy stage of the show when we were just kind of coming with ideas and just kind of going for it. It was a bare bones crew. <laughs> what was really funny is uh, Chris Pontius shows up that day and he had all this stuff in his car. He had his, he had his bicycle shorts on and he had a thong and a woman's bikini. I don't, for what reasons why he had it, I don't know. It's, it remains a mystery till this day. You know, Bunny the lifeguard just came out of nowhere. And he just showed up on the scene. Thank God we had him there because if Knoxville would have, you know, fell in, got a concussion, he would have been swept away. Yeah, Knoxville going for it. You know, he doesn't know how to roller skate at all. And uh, not let alone ride a skateboard. He can kind of surf nowadays. But what's really cool about this moment that I want to share is this picture that Sean Cliver took. He was there with us and he took this great shot. I'm looking at it right now. He took this great shot and it just really shows the simplicity of our production. It's just me on a ladder in the middle of the Ellie River, Knoxville flying through the air, and Bunny the lifeguard in the back there ready to rescue. This photo is amazing. Sean Cliver nailed it on this one. I just love how, <laughs> look at Bunny the lifeguard in the back there. It's so funny. And look at Knoxville just committed, flying. You know, the camera that I was using that day, I still have it. And this is the camera that uh, I used to film the uh, infamous Ellie River jump. Yeah, so this Sony VX1000 was used on a lot of different segments of the TV show, as well as the Big Brother videos. And uh, it's crazy. I still have it, you know, after all these years. So just the other day I was notified I have another picture that's being used on a skateboard deck. And this one happens to be a shorty's board featuring Rosa. Shot this picture of her for the Big Brother cover. And, uh, man, probably some over 20 years ago. Or even longer, 25 years ago, probably. I don't know. It's been a long time. For those of you who don't know who Rosa is, she was the uh, model for Shorty Skateboards. Featured in a lot of their advertisements. She was the original skateboard heartthrob. And, uh, yeah, I got to shoot this picture. And uh, she even autographed it for me, which was really cool. Cossack with hearts on it. I'll never forget, love Rosa. Oh man, that's awesome. You know, I wonder what became of Rosa. I wonder what she does nowadays. I imagine she's probably a mom, has several kids, probably five, uh, a school teacher, maybe a, pr a principal, or she's uh, the leader of a hippie commune. I don't know. I'm sure she's living a great life. And uh, yeah, this is a great memory, so. Thank you, Shorties, for sending me this board. I was really stoked. The other day, I posted up a new video on my channel, and it's from the Big Brother Craft video titled Preston Long Arms. And me and Preston Cuff went around and shot a bunch of skate footage, him dressed in the uh, prison kind of outfit with the long arms uh, sewn on. With uh, We put like fake hands in a broomstick handle, and he had to skate with it. He had like a, uh, a hat on and a long nose just a little it was a fun little video part for the for the crap video nothing crazy yeah i just remember it being fun and even ended up being on the cover of the magazine so yeah cheers to you preston here we are talking about it after all these years that's it for today's episode thanks for tuning in and i'll catch up with you soon